Hey friends, what's up? Welcome to a new video. So today I wanted to talk about four awesome books for creators. These four books really helped shape my life. Is that the right word? These books helped me shape my mindset around being a creator and also gave me some tips and tools and resources to look at for when I'm creating content and just how to elevate the stuff that I make and just to make more meaningful work. So the first book I want to give a shout out to, it is called The War of Art by Stephen Pressfield and you might have seen this all over YouTube. Almost every YouTuber or self-improvement creator has read this book or has shouted it out in some way. So it's it's definitely a good one. So The War of Art is basically about this entity called the resistance and how it lives within every single one of us, whether you're creative or not, and how Stephen Pressfield writes about it. It's kind of like, it's it kind of seems like this antagonist of the book. Like it has characteristics, it has a personality. The resistance is personified and basically that resistance that he's talking about is your procrastination and how a lot of people procrastinate on things that they want or need to get done but it takes the shape or form in different ways. For example, preoccupying yourself with a task that you feel is more important or going out and eating instead of working on this book report or something. This book does a really great job of exposing and analyzing procrastination in various different forms and it gives a lot of good tips on how to overcome the different forms of procrastination. Um, um, and to basically not let your resistance win and to just get your shit done. So the next book I have is called Influencer by Brittany Hennessy and this was one of my favorite favorite books to read. I don't consider myself an influencer. I'm barely on Instagram. My Instagram game is kind of whack but it is better because of this book. In a nutshell it's basically about how to build your brand on social media um, I know when we hear the term influencer, it usually pertains to like Instagram or something, but this book goes beyond just Instagram. It also talks about YouTube and blogging and just overall building your personal brand online and with social media. And I absolutely adore this book because it is valuable, it's chocked full of actionable advice, and also it provides real life case studies and examples. So the book pulls in real life examples from top influencers today, such such as Jackie Ina or Hong Nguyen or Cezanne Hendricks, like so many big names out there that are very relevant today and I felt that that really elevated the value of this book because it's relatable and you know exactly the examples that Brittany is talking about. But in addition to branding, there are also chapters about contracts and building out a team and even the business and money side of being an influencer. So if you're interested in building your brand online or also becoming an influencer and how to turn it into a full-time gig, highly recommend reading this book. So it's no secret that video is pretty much taking over the social media realm. It's becoming a more and more popular form of content these days and I do believe that if you are creating any sort of content online, video should be one of them. So for those of you who are starting out in the video game, I highly recommend YouTube Secrets by Sean Cannell and Benji Travis. I've taken so many YouTube courses when starting out this channel and by far Sean Cannell's courses are like the best and the YouTube channel Video Influencers and Think Media have been the most valuable channels that talk about YouTube that I like ever. Point blank period. This book really is its name, YouTube Secrets. It's basically a guide for when you're starting your YouTube channel from when you're first creating your channel all the way to creating videos and optimizing them and monetizing them and getting views and subscribers. All of that stuff is covered in that book and I really only have good things to say about it. It was probably one of the best books about content creating that I own um, and it's definitely a great investment. Sean Cannell, Benji Travis are great. Um, if you can't afford the book, check out their YouTube channels. They are awesome and they really will help you build your YouTube channel. So the last book that I am going to mention today is not necessarily a book you read, but this is a tool that I've been using to plan out my videos and my content for years and it is 
my passion planner. I'm going to say this in every single productivity video that I make, um, but I highly, highly, highly recommend my passion planner. And it's basically a planner that is focused on goal setting. So in the beginning of the planner, you start off with the big goal and the small goals you want to achieve within like a month, three months, uh, a year, three years, your lifetime. It encourages you to take your big goal and break it down into smaller, more attainable goals and schedule them in the planner. And on top of that, it's an hourly format, so I love how you could visually see where you're spending your time. And it also has checklists and stuff, and I don't know, th this planner to me just makes sense. Um, especially when it comes to achieving your goals. I'm on my fourth passion planner this year and this is the exact same planner that helped me graduate college, it helped me start my blog and really figured out what I wanted to do post-grad and it also helped me become a full-time creator. Um, so with that said, um, I want to say that this planner, like, it doesn't grant wishes. You definitely still have to put in the work. Check it out. I'll leave it linked down below and also a coupon code so you can save a little bit of money. So if you love planning and goal setting and just getting your shit done, then I highly recommend this planner. So with that, those are my four highly recommended books to read if you're a creator. If you have any recommendations of your own, leave it down below. In 2020, I definitely want to read more books and venture out of self-help and self-improvement. Any books about creativity or content creating, then I am all game. If you liked this video and would like to see more content like this, um, just give this video a like and also hit that subscribe button if you want to see more from me. Yeah, so finally, and most importantly, thank Thank you all so much for watching this video and I will see you in the next one. Bye!